Warm greetings from the Earth Charter International Secretariat and our Center on Education for Sustainable Development that is located here on the campus of the University for Peace in Costa Rica. I want to express my appreciation for the visionary efforts of President Makino and Vice President Atsufumi Yokoi to incorporate the values and principles of sustainability as articulated in the Earth Charter and the Sustainable Development Goals in the educational approach of Okayama University. We look forward to a close cooperation with you in this endeavor. As we look at the challenges humanity is currently facing, we need to take a serious look in the role education can play in all of this, especially higher education. The role as a main driver to social transformation towards a more sustainable world. For this to take place, Collaboration across borders, cultures, and areas of knowledge is much needed. After two decades of offering educational opportunities with participants from all regions of the world, our center holds a UNESCO chair on Education for Sustainable Development with the Earth Charter, which implements educational programs and research activities surrounding the areas of education, sustainability, and values using the Earth Charter as a framework. With our work, we seek to build capacity, the capacity of educators and young professionals in different fields to incorporate the knowledge, values and skills needed for a sustainable way of life in their sphere of work. We have a shared interest with Okayama University on this. And I mean, in strengthening the capacity of current and future professionals to understand and implement the vision of sustainability. I believe this cooperation will also help with the implementation of the UNESCO resolution, first adopted in 2003 and then again in 2019, in which they recognize the important role the Earth Charter has as an ethical framework for sustainable development and as an educational instrument. Let me end here by emphasizing that it's time to turn conscience into action for a thriving Earth. Each one of you is invited to learn more about the worldview that is articulated in their charter and consider it as an ethical reference and as a guide to contribute to the transition to a more just, sustainable and peaceful world. Thank you very much and I send you my appreciation and warm regards from Costa Rica. Thank you.